like coming in here on game day. So I've been very fortunate being here with a couple of other theatres as well, and lots of AFL teams, just recently with Damien Hardwick. Uh, I wasn't responsible for their loss to the Gold Coast, by the way. But uh, just to give you a feel for, for how it works. So normally, those that have been down here, you've seen the players out here, bumping into each other, getting a bit of rah-rah stuff going. So they come in, our birds, I'm not shutting you out, mate, because tonight you're passing this on Sunday. So <laughs> coach will come in, players will all be sitting like you are. That's what happens, it gets really silent. There's all these guys out there banging the crap out of each other. Sorry about that, kids. And uh, <laughs> now, different coaches handle it different ways. So, uh, any, any particular coach you like, I, mean, I can do him if, if I've been in the room. Is there any coach you'd like to be pre game by? Wush up. Wush up. Wush up. Yeah, no, no, Wush up. Hennis Pagan goes right off. Wush up's really calm, really relaxed. Uh, really at ease with the whole thing. He comes in and creates quite a calmness. Uh, goes through what they've talked about. Mark Williams is very, a lot of energy. And uh, he gets into it. Damien Harvick, very similar. Dennis Pagan is of the old school. It's depending how far back you want to go. Uh, I was very fortunate in my early days to be in it once with Bill Curley. And uh, that's you watching paint peel off the wall. <laughs> As Curls is pointing to you, you're not really sure who he is pointing to. Yeah, yeah. his fingers are going. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> the messages are all, are all pretty similar. So they, they come in very much in this approach. So normally it's players are in here, coaches are out here, just having a last bit of conversation with assistants. Coach comes in, assistants come in, normally straight here, John knows all this stuff. Now, fellas, do you understand the urgency of things? This is what I'm talking about. There's a lot more adjectives that we won't use, though. <laughs> 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 and that's making it difficult for me to try and <laughs> <laughs> So right now, the Crows are playing. So the Crows are playing, obviously, West Coast. Sam, Jacob, now we've been, how important it is to get into the legs of Matanui. You don't want to compete with him in the air. Ball comes to ground, Scotty Thompson, get on that quick. Need to be on that right from the first bounce. Want to assert our authority early. Tackling's a key for us. <coughs> get after them today. You guys down here, don't be soft. See one of those old grumpy men grabbing by the legs and tripping them over? <laughs> <laughs> don't let them go. <coughs> don't talk well talk. <laughs> <laughs> in their voice, you see, and then depending on <coughs> how important it is. So big game for the Crows today against West Coast. Lucky to get into that scarf, I'll tell you. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> you know, it tells us about our chance. Win this one, two finals games at home. Not talking about putting any extra pressure on. Not talking about looking at the last quarter. Right now we're focused on first bounce. Can we assert our authority early in this game? Then we don't want to get up and suddenly relax. <clears throat> when you get out there, you get a feel for it, reach down, touch the grass, it's just the ground. It's just another team. But we need to be, we need to get the crowd involved. That's where we get our big lift. They all run out, <laughs> rah, 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 rah. Then the siren sounds and the crowd get up, and then away it goes. And that's how it is for you guys today. If you get a chance, you'll feel it. It's a really <coughs> bizarre feeling. As you go down the race, for whatever reason, onto the ground, there's some magic in that. And you, you, you know, you can feel that buzz a little bit when you do it. You kids will feel it. It's really exciting. You go, it's actually a piece of cement. But for whatever reason, wow, I'm out of the stadium. A luxury that not a lot of people get. You know, and the game is so important. So, big crowd in. Now, if you're a coach, Dennis Pagan. Not Dennis Pagan. <coughs> Dennis Pagan. Not well on the board, actually. Now, Pagan, yeah, Pagan only had a colour. In the old days, and he'd come in at a <coughs> I need your attention now. Duck, I'm talking to you, son. I'm looking at you, I'm, I'm eyeballing you too. What you delivered last week was nothing but crap, son. <laughs> but I don't want to see you again today. I'm going to look at you today, come on. Half time, I'll give you the half time speech now because we haven't even got time for it. Rod the Eagles with Rocket last year. Hawthorne up against the Swans. Come on, Minutes, coach. They go. Come in half time. It's 
three blokes sitting there. There's Cooney, there's Barry Hall, first game player. Rockets spewing. He's furious. He comes in through the door, slams the door, makes the beeline straight for Barry Hall. In my mind, I'm watching him. I'm going, bad choice. Yeah. Bad choice. <laughs> Barry Hall, bad choice. Gets to Cooney and sprays the young kid. So even coaches in a crisis will know, no, not him, get him. So <laughs> at half time, if you're down, we might pat you on the <coughs> bottom and say, good job. We might get after you. It's changed. Over time, it has changed. Dennis Fagan, big board, big board banging to get your attention. You know, wasn't what we talked about. Take the mark, get three steps back, get it on. We haven't got time. Don't mess around. <laughs> this is a really difficult yes. route. <laughs> <laughs> The most important thing in all of it is to get out there and have some fun today. So, uh, you know, it's a great opportunity. Like I say, not a lot of people get a chance to get on Amy Stadium. Less people get a chance to get on there and have a game of footy. So you get a chance to do that. So it's a great opportunity. You should enjoy it. Lots of tackling. The old guys really want to get tackled hard by you guys. Rather than chicken wing stuff. That would be a good show. Some of the best players in the AFL do it. Chris Joe did it just like that. Let me help you out of that box. We encourage you to get going, get the shirt up over your head to do this stuff. <laughs> <laughs> or a slide, if you can do a slide in your own. Crowd really like that. Don't be nervous, it won't be any more than 40 or 50,000 people. Like <laughs> 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 I think we're talking about Yeah, no.